Best and Worst Dress Stars on the 2018 ARIA Awards Red Carpet. Sophie Monk brought a very unexpected date and one star got it so, so wrong it's all on show on the ARIA Awards Red Carpet in Sydney. The ARIA Awards are upon us for another year, and what could possibly ruin the party for Australian music's brightest stars? Erm, um, how about the worst November Sydney storms in three decades? Thankfully or disappointingly, Depending on your desire to watch celebs trudge along a wet red carpet like drowned rats the ones in a generation torrential downpours have eased since this morning. With stars arriving on a dry red carpet at Sydney's the star ahead of tonight's ceremony. ARIA Awards Ceremony 2018 All the Winners and Highlights ARIA Awards over the years the best, worst and wildest moments. Homegrown country star Keith Urban's hosting the event and has brought some serious star power to proceedings in the form of his wife, Nicole Kidman. Well see performances from the likes of homegrown boy band Five Seconds of Summer, visiting pop star Rita Ora and Hall of Fame in the T. Cassie Chambers. Also set to perform Amy Shark, who tops the leaderboard with an incredible nine nominations. Expect her to go home with at least a few trophies tonight. Red Carpet Highlights Actual Star Power Nicole and Keith are here. Oh man. Jess Mao boy, you are an A-pop star and an actual queen, so it pains me to rag on you for teaming a pinstripe dress with what appear to be oversized meringue arm flighties. She doesn't have much luck on the Arya's red carpet, does she? Model and partner to Kyle Sanderlands, Immigrant Anthony, has turned up in a darling collection of ribbons from the sassy feisty bimbo bitch collection. Sophie Monk, I'm sorry. You're not allowed to attend any more ARIA awards until you commit to a full-blown Bardo reunion. I don't make the rules. And while Sophie's just gone public with her new boyfriend, marketing exec Joshua Gross, she didn't bring him as her date tonight instead arriving arm in arm with her dad Andrew. Look, we're all adults here, so I'm going to give this to you straight. Stylist Fleur even appears to have come as a giant vagina. Rita Ora is in the house looking about as excited as you could reasonably expect any international pop star attending the Arias to be. Sure, you could ask what on earth early naughty's case of the XRB songs Tress Maya is doing here. I think the more pertinent question is where are the invites for Ashanti, Nevaeh and Blue Cantrell. Chloe Bailey's outfit could stop traffic literally. Insert deafening teenage screams here, it's five seconds of summer. My my my, it's Troy Sivan. Amy Shepard and Emma Shepard from the band You Guessed It Shepard are serving here tan formal realness. Singer Montaigne turned up two years ago with People Over Profit written on her chest this year it's Stop Adani on her cheeks. For the rest of my life I will probably eject at least three loads out of my butt every week, Montaigne said during her bizarre best breakthrough at a speech two arias ago. I'm still thinking about it. Is Samantha Jade's hair a deliberately wet look, or did she just get caught in the rain? Answers on the back of a postcard, please. How embarrassing. Adam Hyde and Ruben Stiles from dance duo Peking Duke turned up wearing the same outfit. You'd think they would've texted before leaving home. Sarah Ellen smizing so hard she's giving me a migraine. You might think Barry Southgate's suit blending in with the media wall is an unfortunate sartorial faux pas, but jokes on you has perfectly camouflaged against any passing apex predators. Farrah Blue's tux situation is very much business on top, party on the bottom. Havana Brown sure knows how to work a red carpet. Alex the astronaut note not an actual astronaut is a vision in velvet. Here's woman of the night, Amy Shark note not an actual shark. Vance Joy, very handsome. I can never remember whether Jess and Matt Price are a married couple or siblings. Or both. Son of Richard, Christian Prince Wilkins and his partner Andrew Kelly. No, he doesn't have some sort of skin virus, those are actually Hello Kitty tats all over his arms and face. That skirt suddenly I'm craving a licorice of sort. The loop host and rumored new girlfriend of Dr. Chris Brown went for disco -lum. DJ Helena Ellis is serving a real J-Lo turn of the century vibe. You might be asking why Bo Ryan's at the Arias, which means you forgot he once released a single with Justice Crew.
I wish I'd forgotten.